Hey guys, what's up? Crimin Go Oz here with a redstone creation video. If you're wondering why I sound so out of it, it's probably because I am. It's p just past 11 p.m. right now, and I really want to get this done before I leave for vacation tomorrow. So, that's what I'm going to do. So, I'm going to try to make this as quick and simple as possible. Um, today I'm going to show you how to build, um, a 1-bit memory capacitor. It's really pretty easy and only takes a minute or so. So you really need to follow my exact lead or you're screwed pretty much. Um, so just do as I do. So just place two blocks um, a block away from each other, then put a redstone torch on the right one. Then you're going to place another stone on top so we have a little triangle and a redstone torch. Then you come over here, um, put down a redstone wire, it should be powered. If you put it in the right spot, put on a redstone torch on this block that you placed right here, it should turn off. So then, once you do that, you're going to build a staircase coming up and then just kind of do that. Oops. Um, I don't know why it's always, always paranoids me, but you always want to destroy that block right there. And then you're going to place two torches on this block. One there, one there. They should both be off. So then you're going to place another torch right there. Should be on. Then you're going to create a line of three stone. One, two, and three. And then you're going to create a line of three redstone right across like this, and a redstone torch right there. Should turn off. If this turns on, and all of a sudden you find that this one's off, um, well, I'm going to show you a trick on how to get rid of that later. So, um, I'm going to call this the output wire. And I'm going to bring that out around and over to... Whoops. To this um, little thing over here. And then you're going to create another line of three stone. One, two, three. And then you're going to place a redstone repeater and then um, two, actually, it's, okay, I lied. Four stone, redstone repeater, two wires, and then an empty space in the middle. And then you're going to create, um, so then you're going to to dig down one block right here and over and this is going to come down and over to a button that I'm going to crash because I'm too lazy to spawn it and I'm going to call this a refresh button. Now see the way this is going to work is I'm going to put an input such as this redstone torch right here. And as you can see, nothing has happened to the output wire. Unless, of course, you hit the refresh button. And oh, 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 what's happened here? It seems to have turned on. But if you take away this torch, it will turn off, right? wrong. It is staying on with the output wire. And you can do many, 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 many things with this. And the many of those things I have yet to figure out. And um, that's what has led me to this little contraption hiding behind my little wall over here. Um, This is made of, um, let's see, well, 
I'm going to crunch some numbers for you really quick. Um, I separated this into three different compartments. One, two, and three. Each one of these lanes in each compartment is 25 bits, or 25 um, memory capacitors. And each one of the outputs I am referring to as a bit. And there are nine of these going up in each compartment. And 25 times 9 is... Where's it, where's it calculate when you need it? 25 times 9 is... 225. No. Yes. Yeah. 225. So there are 225 bits in each compartment. And 225 times 3... Oh gosh. I'm not good at math this late at night. I guess I'm going to have to write it down. Alright. So... 225 times 3 is, okay, the 1, 7, bring that over, the 6, 675. 675 output wires are in, is the total amount, so there are 675 total output wires of what you see back here. And I was planning to put a monitor screen back here. And I was planning to keep putting in like messages. At just like as um just for fun I suppose. And um so yeah, six hundred seventy five bits is actually a bit is one eighth of a byte. So if I divide 675, ugh, by 8, 67, 64, 8, 35, 32, and then, see, um, there's a 3, and then that's 24, and that's just about 84 bytes. And one byte is equal to the to the um, computer memory capacity of one letter. So you could store um, eighty approximately eighty four letters on the monitor screen if I were to build one. And so I I, I believe that's my understanding of it. Um, please, someone correct me if I'm wrong if I got like the calculations mixed up or something but yes so this is a 675 bits compute not exactly computer it's a memory capacitor and um I, my goal was actually 1025 to beat that um one guy I think his name was Zakaro who built a 1024 bit so I'm gonna try to beat his record and it'll be quite a project um I'll probably revisit this later to show you the finished result and um as you can see each and every one of these the only problem is that I have to install each one of the inputs manually so if I put input there You can see that it's not on. And everything you see here is powered by this one button. This one button. So if I hit it, then see if I can find where I put that torch. Ah, there it is. So I'm going to fly up and over and then down oh yep you see an output there 
So I'm planning to build a monitor screen, hook each one of these up to an inverter. So um, only the um, ones, the, only the chosen outputs will churn, will have um, torches that are on. And that is my 675 bit capacitor. I hope you enjoyed um, this little tutorial. Um, I'm just going to give you one last little walk around of it. Oh, and by the way, this um, does reset itself. Um, if you hit the refresh button again, you can see that um, after there's no input, um, there will it will turn off again. So there's a refresh button. It's kind of like the enter and undo button at the same time. So, yeah. Um, I hope you guys enjoy this. I'm gonna try to edit this as quick as possible and upload it to YouTube. And then post it on my Minecraft Facebook page. And, yeah. I'll see you guys in my next video. Stay awesome. See you later.